Plebe summer is officially over for the Naval Academy's class of 2023. Yeah, Sean Stryker was there as the midshipmen got to finally see their friends and family for the first time since June. For the past six weeks, the young men and women going through their plebe summer at the U.S. Naval Academy have only been able to speak to their families three times. Well, today they were reunited with their loved ones. As 12,000 plebes fell into formation at the United States Naval Academy, the Thomas family waited in anticipation. I'll probably cry. <laughs> Already crying. No, it's just just thrilled for him, really. It's been six weeks since they dropped off their son Jack to start his plebe summer. It was tough at first. Um, the first call uh, wasn't great. But each call got better and letters helped. And now plebe summer is over. The past weeks filled with training, drilling, preparing for life as a midshipman. I could not be prouder. He, he, when he was in middle school, he said he wanted to do this. And I said, it's really hard to get in. Once you're there, it's going to get hard to make it through. And he got in, and I, right now he's persevering, and I couldn't be prouder of him. That feeling of pride radiating from the crowd of 3,000 friends and family. I'm very proud. I'm prior service as well. It's, I don't even have the words. I'm just so proud of, of him and all the other plebes. And while there's still long ways to their 2023 graduation, it's the first step of the long journey. It, it was very hard at first, a lot harder than I expected, but I'm very happy I persevered and got through this first step. Now the plebes will have the weekend to enjoy with their friends and family before returning to prepare for the academic year. Reporting from Annapolis, I'm Sean Stryker for WJZ.